Hey everyone, and welcome back. So today you're getting to see the studio from a way different angle than usual, but it is directly related to understanding how much today's product is a game changer, because I want you to see the setup from an angle that I normally see it and to understand the problem that this product is actually solving. Now, since the beginning of the channel three years ago, I've been using these standard little microphone arms here that you can get on Amazon for about 20 or $30. And you know what? I've got to say, for someone starting out, it's an awesome way to start out. They are generally pretty versatile. Even the camera I'm talking to you guys on right now is on the same kind of arm as this one is. So I won't stop using them all together. But for my microphone, it's always been a huge, huge issue. Now, without getting into too many details, I do not have any overhangs that I can use to hang a microphone from the top. And I even tried a boom arm, but because of the overall room setup, just so you understand, it just doesn't work. So I was looking for a long time for another solution. And that's where Fine Fine came around because a couple of months ago, I did a review for one of their headsets. And then once the review was done, they really liked it. So they said, look through our catalog and see if there's anything else you'd like to review. And looking through their catalog, I saw a low rise microphone arm. And looking more and more into that low rise microphone arm, I realized that it's probably the solution I've been looking for for all that time. So maybe you guys haven't realized what the problem is yet. So let me show you guys what I mean. So as you can see, I have a multi-screen setup here. But the problem is, is that no matter where I place this arm, this one of the screens is always being hidden by the microphone arm itself. If I place the arm here, I hide this screen, which is my play screen. If I place the microphone arm in front of me, I'm blocking either one of the two screens in front of me. And right now I'm doing the lesser of all evils and I'm blocking the screen that normally I'm recording my OBS on. And you're wondering, okay, so it's not that bad. You can set up your OBS ahead of time and whatnot. But if you've ever seen me stream and I've had to either switch viewpoints or correct something in OBS, you'll always see me doing this. Why? Because I'm trying to get a viewpoint that is around basically the screen so that I can see all the buttons, all the dials, or correct what I need to correct. It's just a pain in the butt since I've started the channel. And honestly, I received this low rise arm almost two months ago, and I've been wondering how I could do a review on it because it's hard. It's, it's, a, it's a microphone arm. And I thought the best way I would show, do it is like I'm doing right now, showing you the before and the after and how much it changed everything. Because not only is it gonna correct the fact that the boom arm is sort of in the way of my screens, if you look at the microphone USB cable, it's just wrapped around the arm right now and it goes into a sort of little knot down here so that it doesn't keep moving. Well, Fine Fine's low rise arm has cabling in it. It has a channel to channel the cable through and as you can see, as usual, Topaz has come to visit us this morning. So it is going to solve a lot of problems. And you know what? Topaz is going to most likely be able to jump onto me without doing a sort of like little acrobatics work here, like she's trying to do right now. So next viewpoint, you are going to see me set up the fine, fine microphone arm, and we're going to look at the finalized product and see how much it changed the studio and the mic setup.
So here we are back and the installation is complete. And I've got to tell you all, the difference is monumental. Uh, basically, vision wise, I can see everything. And I even filmed a video from my perspective using my cell phone, which I'll play for you guys now. There is nothing blocking any ones of my screens anymore. And on top of it, the microphone is still right up in my face. Now, on top not only cable management is better, but I'm leaving the microphone on a swivel, so sound might be weird a little bit as I'm moving it. Yep. But I'm leaving my microphone for me on a swivel so that I can adjust it, move it around as I need. And even if I put it right up here against the screen, it's still not blocking any of my vision, which is why these low rise arms are such a great thing to have. If you have a setup like mine where you have no choice but to put the microphone on the front part of your desk, you can also lock it in place. Using the same key, if you need like a 45 degree R angle on the arm here, all you need to do is take the key, adjust in the a little port here, you tighten it up, and your microphone is going to stay at the angle you chose. You can also lock the angle of each one of the arms separately using the same provided key that they gave to you in the pack. For me personally, however, I'm going to be leaving it free, free going, meaning that I'm not going to lock it into any place because it's actually at the perfect height, just at its normal hanging height. Now, it's weird to call this a review of a product because it's really a product that if you're in the right situation, it's a game changer. Like basically replacing this old thing with this, as I said, not only from the cable management perspective, but just now I do not have to adjust my vision at any point while I'm streaming or recording videos. On top of it, Topaz is most likely going to be easily able to jump off of the desk onto me now, so I won't have as much problems trying to get her over the microphone stand. So, overall, if you are looking, if you have a very small setup, you don't have a lot of maneuvering room, these low-rise arms, especially the one from Fine Fine, is extremely well designed. It is very sturdy as well, and I'll be leaving the link down below. By the way, I didn't per se it at the beginning, but this is not a sponsored video. They did provide the product for free, but I was free to say whatever I wanted about it. So if in the end it wouldn't have worked out properly, I would be telling you all. But no, this product is actually, I am super happy to have it. And I'm finally happy to be able to, ins to, be able to install it permanently. Because I, as I said, I've had it for two months and I had to put it on and off, on and off, so that I could properly film this video. And now we're at the point where I'll be able to put it on permanently. And basically, as I said, it's going to be a game changer for me. So as usual, if you did like the video, hit that like button. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel, and as usual, I hope I'll see all of you in my next video.